Okay, so I think I'm going to start talking about um, doing here. Um, so I was watching Meg's Lockley again. And she was doing her Shannon Green's Journaling by Fives again. And I've done it before too. And it seems to be... You know, a good idea to go through it again. Just do it again. So I'm going to start the timer whilst I talk. Um, and this time I'm doing it slightly different to the way I did it before. Firstly, I am doing the prompts in a different order. I'm doing the collage first rather than the paint, as Shannon suggests, just because this is how my brain. Um, wants to work. This is how I would normally start, so that's what I'm doing. I've got my time set for 15 minutes and it's going. I should probably just only start it now. Uh, yes, yeah, so I'm talking to you so I don't think too much. And I am just going to use a little bit of journalism. So, yeah. And I'm also working on a smaller journal. I noticed that Shannon's journal is was considerably smaller than mine, which was a bit of a struggle to fill the page in such a short time. I have to say. So I'm hoping with a small page it won't be so much of a problem. Although I am going to get into all sorts of sticky messes. Of course it doesn't have to be glued down perfectly right now. I can come back in the free play section and just stick everything down properly. Also I am going to work... This is one page one and this is page two. I'm going to work like that. In this journal, and I'm working from the back of this sketchbook because I've worked a lot in the front already, and really I need to even it out so that the spine doesn't go all twisty and difficult to work with so yeah so I'm thinking that this will be a bit more interesting when I first did this it was when I first started my channel and you know I'm fairly new to art journaling and you know Artists are always growing and changing and developing new styles, finding new, new ways of doing things. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to be really interested to see how different this one's going to be. I am definitely not used to doing grab and glue sort of things. I don't have a stash of collage images, so that's going to be an interesting one when we get to the focal image. So I'm probably going to end up using a few bits of ephemera and some stamps and things like that as focal images, which is fine. I think that's going to be a bit more me, so... Yeah, I fold that. And another reason why I decided to do this was because I have a lot of scraps and bits and bobs hanging around. Basically, I just need to use them up. So, what better way? I can't see the time because it's gone off. minutes left and we've done three pages so far in five minutes 
need to get a bit faster, I think. Probably should have used the glue stick to begin with. Some happy mail that someone sent me. It's off the edge of a map. And it's all in German, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong, please do. Definitely gonna run out of time. <laughs> so, if you can hear my computer running in the background, I am editing videos as we speak. Uh, so, I have lots, lots, and lots, and lots of stuff to edit. To wipe off paper, print paper from Naldi magazine thingy. I actually think that was quite cool. This is from when I tried to print off Mike's um, mission inspiration prompts and it printer wouldn't work so I've just put gel plate over the top. Gel plate printing. Red oranges. Come on. Okay, six minutes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Gee, all right. Six, eleven. minutes left and I've got like nine pages left to do
less than five minutes. I am not going to get this done. If I remember rightly, I didn't. I don't think I managed many of the prompts on time last time. So. Yeah. I should have pre-torn some pages or something. Black and white. Ooh, three pages. Two pages. I want this one. masking tape these pages because they are falling out for some reason. I've probably pulled a page out and it's loosened it.
So I've glued all that down there. Let's just do a quick flip through. That's the first two pages. There we go, it's 20 pieces. Um, my next challenge will be to add some paint. And that's going to be very interesting. <laughs> so join me for the next one. Thank you for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.